Hey, welcome back to the next part of Hogwarts Legacy. Okay, so last episode, um, see we're in the library right now and now we're the only ones in this bitch, which honestly, I didn't take a good look. <gasps> Mine. <laughs> um, I didn't take a good uh, look at this bitch the last time I was in here, but honestly, it really slays. Um, but we were in here in the last episode in the, is it called the forbidden section? You know, the no touchy section. And, oh, we just found some money in there. And, um, we went with Sebastian and then dumbass, uh, Peeves found us. And then Sebastian told the librarian that, uh, that we had nothing to do with it. And he saved us. That was so zaddy of him. I can't wait to see him after that. I wonder if we can go up these twirly steps. Okay, let's go. Oh, there's somebody laying on the floor over here with a little, what is that? Honestly, this would be me as fuck if I was at Hogwarts. Laying on the floor of the library with a little light. That is so cute. And then... Um, so now we need to return to Professor Fig's classroom, which I'm gonna do in a second when I stop dicking off. I just wanted to see the upstairs, which I'm surprised it lets us come all the way- Look how beautiful this is. Like, holy moly. I want to go here. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love just living in fantasy worlds in my head because I really just came from the underworld and now we're at Hogwarts. Wow. Love that for us. <laughs> But, oh wait, that's not the door. Girl, go out the damn door. Go. Up the stairs. And then, where is Professor- I don't even think we've been over here before. Oh, wait, I see a page. I see it. Okay. Let's go to Professor Figs. I love having magic. Wow. Which I guess I could just fast travel there, but I love looking at all the stuff around the school still. Also, I need to figure out where to buy more of those health potions because as you can see on my bottom right corner, um, I don't have any and that's a little uh, worrisome. Ooh, tomatoes. Wait, that's not a tomato. What is that? I don't know. A tentacle? A tent tomato. I don't know. Running. Oh, it's so gorgeous! Did that man mean mug us? Probably. I just don't even pay attention to men anymore unless they're Sebastian. Hogsmeade is where you buy potions. I gotta go back back to Hogsmeade. I hope that um Sebastian's gonna be my escort again. Speaking of, is he over here? Is that him? No, that's not him. Is he over here? No. I see a bunch of Slytherins, but not him. We're supposed to go down the steps, I think. Wait, is it up there? Oh, I passed it. Hold on. Um, it's fine. I love running in circles. Where the fuck is it? Is it still up more stairs? Up and up. Yeah, it's over here. Okay. Oopsies. Not the squids making it in the Hogwarts Legacy. Thank you, Tess. Do, 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 do. And now it's gonna be like, wait, or begin. Okay. Take the book to Professor Fig. Okay, so now we gotta go into his office. You know, this man calls us into his office very often. Ooh, the principal's in here. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. You call me a fucking liar? It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. So was that the principal or was that somebody else? I was a soldier and got to go to Azkaban. Um, I'm a 
mandated reporter. He better not keep calling you into your his office. Um. Uh, I don't know if I'll play as the other houses. Um. The arrow tells you which way to go. That was, see, I thought that was a principal. Okay, let's see what he has to say to us. What? That's. Wait. You accessed the restricted section, but how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Yeah, now you're Fair enough. Business. In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. A look at what? Oh, the book. Okay. Oh. Oh, dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Well, fuck. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. It may take some time. Mm. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from Why a drought. Why such a kiss Marian ass? was oh right. God. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who Unclasp started as a your hippie, hands, bitch. Like I did. Ugh. She could see traces of magic, too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. Uh, okay, what will you tell him? You might, uh, find him creepy, but we're gonna be working with him till the end. Damn it! What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry oh, about Ranmore. Oh, that's what saying. I don't know no how avail. much I dare say. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. Next time somebody tries to get some tea out of me, that's what I'm saying. I don't know how much I dare say. And when they look at me crazy, I'm not giving them any further explanation. I don't know how much I dare say. I don't know. Hmm. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. I want to go There's to more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. He's not keeping us occupied. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. I know how much I can learn from my friends. Sebastian got me into that fucking library. Speaking of which, I gotta check on Sebastian. Uh, okay, what's our next quest? Hold on. Let's go into the thing. Let's, um... Where's our quest? Quest. No assignments? Just live as a student? I don't even have a class schedule, bitch. What do you mean, live as a student? Where is Sebastian? Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow. And it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Okay, Natty, Natty sent us a text. So, why does he still want me to read that? I don't know. Why can't I move? Okay, there we go. Natty just sent you an outpost regarding to meet her in Lower Hogsfield, a hamlet. Okay, well, where the hell is that? Um. Oh, the world map. Oh, this shit is big, and I'm already confused just running around the castle. Okay. Okay, this is the hamlet, it's like a smaller area. Okay. Well, let's go Professor run around Fink for a minute Weasley before I- I've asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Oh my god, I am never complaining about not having anything to do again, because as soon as I do, now I got all these people hitting me up, wanting me to do stuff for them. That guy looks... he looks. And then... 
I'm gonna run around for a minute, actually, before I do y'all shit. Well, actually, let me let me be en route to uh, Natty since she's so fucking far away and I can look at stuff on the way there. So let's look at this world map. Girl, that map is gigantic. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And we gotta get all the way down here to her. Good lord Jesus. Okay, we're gonna set a waypoint. Look how much, how far we're about to have to travel on foot. <sighs> yeah, it's probably best we go ahead and start this right now. We're running to Natty. After this live, I'm about to take a bath and read in the bathtub and light a candle and put on some instrumental Victorian music because talking about it during the live earlier really has me in the mood. I Every time I come outside, I'm really just like, wow. You don't have a broom? No, I don't have a broom. We haven't done that class yet. They got me running on foot, probably so I can look at all this shit. Hey, just so y'all know, my shit froze for a second, so I like stopped and restarted the stream. So if you hear me talking to people about that, that's why, but you miss nothing. I'm just still running on foot trying to get to this damn quest. So yeah, sorry about that. I had no idea that it did that. Anyways, we're still just running. We're Do running come and find her. me if you stumble on something. And she wants us to figure out this mystery. fucking picture. Lumos. Oh, look. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay, a fountain or some shit. Over here. Mm -mm -mm. I guess we're doing a little side quest right now. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh, follow me, butterfly. Oh, this is so cute. Look at our little butterfly. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Unicorn Farts. Thank you, Tris. Oh my goodness. Look at our little... I don't want to let it go. I don't want to put it back in the frame. Look how cute it is. Oh. Okay, um... I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Why do I have to tell her? She can't look at it? Oh, thank you. Um, I guess we'll go tell Lenora really quick and then we'll be back on the way to Natty. Lenora, we did what your dumbass couldn't do in two seconds. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I'm not telling. I'm afraid I can't tell you, Lenora. Surely you jest! I am not. You should have worked it out on your own. You have nerve! Especially since I'm the one who told you about it in the first place! Look. Imagine solving a riddle that I mentioned and then not telling me the answer! Well, Perhaps I'm a Slytherin. I don't know what you expected. Anyways. Infuriating, know it all. Um, let's check out our little map again, because now I have no fucking idea where I'm going once again. Thank you, Angela. She's feisty for Hufflepuff. Did you change your eyebrows? No, we still look crazy with our eyebrows. Okay, we're going to meet with Natty. Yeah, we're going to meet with her. Is it? Yeah, we're tracking towards it again. I've no doubt that that Not her soul game? <laughs> no, she was mad as fuck. Girl, all you had to do was light up your wand and then throw that butterfly back in there. Obviously. <laughs> you can tell I was a Hufflepuff because I was like, eyeballs. <laughs> We're in the bell tower. Oh, I love it in here. They're talking about Professor... Oh, not the ghost waving to us. Hi! Are we about to go outside now? Oh, my lanta. It's gorgeous. Oh, my God. Remember in the Harry Potter movies what went down right here? Because I do. Anyways, moving on. Look at where we should be playing Quidditch. I guarantee they're going to come out with some, like, DLC for Quidditch. And that's why they said that we're not playing this year. Am I going the wrong way? Oh. <clears throat> we just witnessed her origin story. How much is this game? Um, I think it's like 
Is it 50 or $60? It's pretty much the same as like other, you know, games that aren't The Sims. Like how they all come out, like $60 or whatever. It's on sale right now. Oh, that slays. How much is it on sale for? On sale 20 something. Oh, if it's on sale for $20, then I would definitely recommend getting it. But I don't know what all you can play it on. Like I'm playing it on, can I get in this? I'm scared. Am I gonna drown? Wait, can I swim? Am I going the wrong way again? I think I am. But you know what? I want to see if I can swim. Oh shit, I can. We're swimming. I'm swimming. I'm swimming outside of Hogwarts. Wow. I wonder where out. Wait, aren't there mermaids in this bitch? Let me get out. Let me get out. <laughs> I got on silver 35. That's the race. Get, how do I get up this shit? Okay, there we go. Thank you, Adev. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, wait. Fine. Okay, here we go. Ooh, I see a crystal! Is that amethyst? <laughs> What is this? Um, Lumos. Yeah. Oh! I don't know what that just did for us. Oh, we collected it. Okay. Cute! Okay, moving on. It says we need to go up a little bit more and then around. <gasps> Wait, the little mushroomies! Look at them! The toad- the leaping toadstool caps. You near Hogsmeade? We're meeting her in Lower Hogsfield, is what it says. I love this. Look at our view right now. Ugh! If you're one of those people who, like, really appreciates the little things in video games, then you will like this game. But if you're just looking for some, like, crazy-ass storyline, which, I mean, I'm not that far in yet, but, it, I mean, Skyrim, I think, is a lot more in-depth when it comes to, like, storylines. If you're looking for a game kind of similar to this, that's, like, a big world and whatever, Skyrim. But if you really like Harry Potter and shit like that, the details on this game so far are crazy. Can I slide? Huh. No. Ugh. Running around Lower Hogs Field. There's a bird. There's those things floating around. Oh, we're getting close. Definitely one of the previous games I've played. That's what I'm saying. <gasps> a llama! Wait, that's a goat. That's definitely a goat. I wonder what would happen if we like. Oh! I'm sorry. I just wanted to see if I could hit you. I'm glad you didn't die. Look at it! Oh my goodness! Look at all those chickens! Okay, she's down here. This looks intriguing. That's a ram? Nah, same thing. Whatever. It's a furry animal on all fours. Why is she doing the Jack Sparrow run? <laughs> no, she really is. Oh, shout out to Brenna. That's another one of my sisters. Y'all know I got a million of them. Brenna made a TikTok just for this today. See, Brenna, now I saw your comments. I didn't see them in the Sims one earlier. <sighs> Wait, let me get that blue to flame. See you, my friend. What you want, Natty? Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. 
I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. So you I'm made us right come all the way out here? If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? Um, I don't want to tell Natty because I don't know if I can trust her like that. So I'm going to say I can't say. I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm, a bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll Ooh, attack. not everybody talking and about I us. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Fuck yeah. I'm glad to Good. hear it. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. Mm. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. Mm. I overheard some of She's Rookwood's lads talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. This is a bitch with I shall reach out right when now. I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, CK. Thank you, Natty. Not you going ahead and telling her. Be no, literally. God. Now, Natty, I fuck with the vision. I don't know why you made me come all the way down yonder for you to tell me that. What's going on here? Hold on. Wait, Natty, don't leave. Somebody is in danger. Oh no, and now Natty's fucking gone. Um. Um, there's also a person right there, but I think that's a side quest person. I think this is the main quest over here. So I guess let's do this. They must have come this way. Think! Oh no. Leave this old man alone. I've no idea who it is you think I might Leave this old lady alone. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your Doxy's nip? Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. I don't give a doxy's nip what you want. Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Oh shit, we gotta fight. Nobody will listen. Bitch, don't make me fuck you up right now. Bitch, you must have forgot that I am the chosen one. You must have forgot that I am not here to fight. Wait. Bitch. Oh. Oh my god! And that was light work. Oh, what is that? Oh, watch the light go out of your eyes. Bitch, I will fuck you up. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with a new whatever type. Now, what I don't like is the fact that I only have, I don't have any good spells in my repertoire right now. And that's not exactly great, but anyways. I'm not going anywhere. Nora, get the fuck up. We're fighting bad guys right now. And this lady just said she's gonna take the light out of me. Who's next? Who else? Bitch. Bitch. Have fun with the mermaids. Anybody else? Anybody else wanna fuck with me right now? Wanna fuck with this fifth year? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Been so close to Hogwarts. Yeah, Nora, these these hoes hate me. They're worse than the Sims. Are you all right? 
I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. Putting up a whole ass tent while there's a castle right next to you is your first mistake. <laughs> Who's Priya? Priya, whatever. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin. Gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Aww. Typical hardworking Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. Oh. She's a traveling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands. I'm sure before we'll see I her do. at some point. You're a researcher. I did her so dirty with these at eyebrows. Your house. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Thank you, Lisa. Um I thought that Merlin and the Tales about King Arthur's court were mere myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. Thank you, Alyssa, for the good night. How fascinating. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? Why do I have we to can do see it? What it's comes your of damn our shit. Little hypothesis. You know, whatever. Whatever, I'll get you damn Mallow Suite. I bought a Mallow trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. Oh, at least she already has it. Okay, you know what, this isn't that bad. This trunk. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. Okay, we're taking... I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. How do I set it down? Oh. <laughs> the way we just sprinkled it like basil! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! Oh, what you the vines disappearing? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Oh, I got you, bitch. This is so obvious. We gotta light these hoes up. Hold on. I got just the spell for this. Hold on. Hold on. Uh. Incendio. Fallen's beard. The flames make the pyre sink. Dude. Oh, I didn't do it right. Or maybe I got too close? Curious. Oh, wait. The pyres are back where they started. Well, shit, what did I do wrong? Maybe this one first? Or I have to do it quickly? Incendio! Hurry! Clearly, all three of these pyres are meant to be lit. She said clearly they're all three meant to be lit. I hear you, bitch. I'm trying. 
do them all before one falls all the way down. Ugh! Okay, I'ma try running. I'ma try sprinting. Here I was thinking I was so smart. Incendio. Run! Run! Merlin's beard. We did that shit. What a day. I can hardly believe it. Okay. Well, that's cute. We made a cute place to take photos. I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. The pleasure is all and mine. be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Well, glad we could save your ass and figure out your puzzle, Nora. Glad we could do that for you. All right, I'm going to be ending this live here. Mostly because my legs are cramping like shit. Um... And I'm like three videos behind on uploading these to YouTube. And I know the other people are going to want to see it later. So I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. That quest was interesting. Thank you, Angela. I hope you guys enjoyed this back-to-back -back live with first doing Reaper's story and then doing this one. Um, have a good night. Ah, what game is this? This is Hogwarts Legacy. Super fun. My first time. This is the furthest I've gotten so far so super excited about continuing on um but thank you guys so much for watching thank you erica for the good night and sam for the ice cream cones and i will see you tomorrow for the patreon only live and i'm sure i'll be posting some tiktoks and whatever and catching up on youtube so i love you guys have a good night